Hello, hello. Good morning, ladies. Can you hear me all right? Yeah, can good. hear you now. Yes, we can hear you. Good, 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 good. We'll just wait for a few to join us. Oh, there's our Sunny. Hello, Annie. <laughs> Hello, Sunny. How, how was the trip or the dive? Ah, oh, the diving, it was good. Saw so many tropical fish. It was just wow. that. <laughs> Yes, although, health alert, my daughter, who I just sat next to for six hours on a plane, has just come down with COVID. Oh, no. And we're supposed to be going to New Zealand on Friday. So I'm like, ah. So James and I are just going, do you feel all right? Do you feel all right? We're like, yeah, we both feel fine. <laughs> um, but she, she, has, yeah, she actually came home from the the trip and said I got a headache and then all day yesterday she mm. said oh, I'm feeling really sick I've got a very scratchy throat and I've got I feel a little dizzy and I'm like oh that's no good you've really wiped yourself out on this holiday and um anyway we will see <laughs> we will see but I feel fine at the moment <laughs> cross your finger <laughs> oh, let's cross our fingers here's our beautiful Ali coming in from UK hello everybody Hello, Ali. We have Sunny and we have Susie. Sunny, I don't think you've met Susie. Susie's in Australia um, with uh, me. Um, Susie's doing um, my Dominate program and um, she can share about herself in a second. And here comes Laura. Laura's, Laura will keep us entertained. We haven't seen Laura for a while. <laughs> oh, I know Laura. Hey, Laura. Good to see you. Laura. Hi, gorgeous. <laughs> oh, I think you've had a haircut um it's looking short you got the short locks yeah i got the short locks <laughs> got the short locks shut the locks all righty well today is i'm sure more and more will join us because i had at least probably what six or eight said they were coming along but we will record this uh session because just because i've got um another pre-record to do in half an hour so uh for those of you who are still joining us um just watch the replay watch the replay um, so first of all, thanks for coming along to our, our publishing, get published in 2023 meeting. It is super exciting to get published. Why do those of you who are watching this or coming along today want to get published? Because it is seriously one of the best ways to increase, elevate your profile globally, right? Getting your name in a book, getting yourself as a one of the uh, participants in a book, whether in, which is called an anthology, is seriously awesome for different reasons. If you're wanting to do your own book, which I know some of you are, um, it is just um, you either then get a signature book, which is what you're the expert in that niche about, which just makes you the one if that's your topic. You know, if you want to talk about being the the spare to the air, then you write your book and everyone knows about it, right? Um, Annie Gibbons has two sets of twins. She writes a twins book. So we have it. So it might be something that you're just wanting to share your story or it might be that you are um, actually wanting to um, have a profile builder um, book. So I think most of you here are looking at doing an anthology this year, uh, which is writing a chapter of one of um, Women's Biz publishing books so welcome kelly lovely to have you join us hello 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 um so first of all i'd love you all to just so that you're all connected right in the chat just your name a web link what book you're going to be interested in if you're wanting to do your own book if you're doing one of the um anthologies just so that we can just double check after this um that we've got you up to speed so First of all, I thought I would just run through really, really briefly what's on offer from Women's Biz Publishing, um, and then you can ask any questions that you've got. Uh, we'll do a really, really speedy intro. Susie, tell us who you are. Hi there. Um, I'm Susie Michael, and um, I am in, am in media. I'm a writer, editor, TV producer, and presenter. And um, I joined Annie to escalate my brand and really get out there and um, do some more speaking opportunities, write a book, 
all the wonderful things that she offers to um, launch women and really launch their brand and make them success. Perfect. So she's doing all the right things. Tick, 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 tick. <laughs> awesome. Who are you, Sunny? Hi, so I'm Sunny. I'm now living in the United States, but original from Taiwan. And um, I see a lot of different opportunity, but I think I particularly would like to participate in that heart warrior because that is my journey. I really just found this place and go down there. <laughs> and I think that is a, such an amazing people everybody should experience. Now I am the holistic lifestyle mentor. I integrate the tiny habits and uh, modern science and also a lot about the Eastern philosophy into my guidance for put people over 40 to get back that self and really just live the true authenticity and for making more impact to the world. Perfect. Thank you. Perfect. So you've got a heart warrior. You're looking at a heart warrior. Susie's looking at memoirs of successful women. Uh, Kelly Markey, intro yourself. Yes, sure. Good morning, everyone. I'm Kelly Markey. I work in medical IT. I became an author by accident. Uh, I didn't realize that I wanted to write until I wrote my first book. It's been amazing. I've been inundated to write more. So I've taken the plunge. I've written another book. So watch the space. And I guess my motto in life is to enhance humanity, to think critically. And I've got amazing feedback from my first book. So I've decided to embark on this journey with Annie to help that um, speed my course. And um, I'm interested in Heart Warrior. Cool, 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 cool. And those of you who think, gee, yeah, Kelly might look a bit um, uh, familiar. She's the cover on Women's Biz Magazine. Woohoo! From uh, last, when was it? November? September. September edition. Amazing. Um, she's everywhere and her book Soar is just soaring. Uh, so fantastic. Uh, Dr. Laura. Oh my God, Annie, I'm so glad to be here with you. And um, my name is Dr. Laura Cobb. I'm a life coach, counselor, author, speaker, blah, blah, blah. The most important thing is that I am so excited to work with Annie again. I'm so excited to support her. And I would like to very much work with um, Heart Warrior only to the extent that um, trauma to triumph. Mm. Yeah, I, I, I enjoy hearing women's stories of having having them tell their process of how they have transformed their lives. Um, a week ago, I actually had a, a human sex trafficker um, speak on my stage on Clubhouse. And uh, it was moving, it was on unveiling and it was exactly the, the thing that um folks women men need to hear mm. so i i listen to stories that allow there's allow their experience because when we make sense s-e-n-s-e -E, of our experience we can make sense c-e-n-t-s of our experience mm. and i'm so grateful to be here thank you so much annie for allowing me this opportunity i adore you <laughs> Great to see you again, Dr. Laura. Uh, Ali, do you want to introduce yourself? Yeah, thanks, Annie. Um, it's a pleasure to see everyone again, aside from Rosie. I don't think that we've ever had any interaction with email, so um, it's great to see everyone again. I am the um, exec producer to Annie Gibbons. I was trying to sound very posh right then. Um, so I work, so I probably, you've probably seen me either on social media um, emails or one of these meetings. So I've been working with Annie for over a year. So I thoroughly love this world. Um, I'm also a writer, author, ghostwriter, and I have an absolute passion for words and for storytelling. And I think that, you know, I was reading an, a stat today about how 40% of people have a book in them that a publisher will want, but only X amount can even get past the first 700 words. So it's no easy feat. It's so much more than a project. It's a legacy because the words will be there forever now. So I'll be the person who will support you through the process um, alongside Annie with regards to the whole publishing process, the editing process, and then all the lovely, yummy, heartwarming friendship support, though, I think that's also really necessary. So I look forward to working with you all. And yeah, thanks for having us, Annie. 
Oh, such a joy, such a joy. So those of you, all of you will get to know Ali very well. She will just make sure that all the dot I's got get dotted. If you're, if we will stay to time, we will, if you need help along the way, she will be like, yep, you know, if you don't hold back, just let her know early. She is an incredibly gifted writer. She has her own memoir coming out very soon as well. Uh, and she's already been through this whole cycle with um, our latest um, anthology, which is um, A Woman's Guide, which is actually a very, very chunky anthology because we had so much interest in it. So uh, you are in a very, very good hand. Uh, Rosie, just tell us a quickly who who you are, what you are excited about doing this year. Hi everyone. Um, I actually don't know how I landed into this group, but obviously there's a reason. <laughs> I've always wanted to be a writer. Um, as long as I can remember, I've always wanted to write, and I love writing. Um, just being very creative with my writing. I love um, doing inspirational quotes. Uh, four years ago, I closed down my business overnight and I was eight and a half months pregnant. It was a very traumatic time for me in my life. When I look back now, I probably had depression. And over the last four years, I've gone through a complete journey of self-healing. And I think that's what my book's going to be about. But I don't know where to start or where to go with it. But this is basically where I'm being guided to go. So. Oh. Excellent, excellent. Great to have you join us. Thank uh, you. Lovely. Justine. Good morning, Annie. Good morning. Um, well, I've co-authored four books already, um, written and illustrated a children's book, um, and am writing my own book um, at the moment. And I just thought I'd pop in because what you don't know, you don't know, and see what you are offering and... Um, Awesome. Uh, go from there. So. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Gorgeous Puja. Hello, gorgeous. Hi, how are you all? Happy New Year. Um, most of the faces I know, a uh, few are new, so hello to them. And uh, it has been an interesting journey with Annie. Her, She's contagious. I mean, you know, the way she works, I have seen her working during her holiday also. And it was amazing the day, I, I mean, I had a chat with Jane. She was a co-author on the other book, Business Domination. And uh, we were chatting that, you know, Annie is available 24-7. And that is like, you know, really interesting. And she's all the time has good punchlines. So uh, it's really <laughs> fun to be with her. And I've worked with Ali as well uh, for the book. So I know both of them, the, their process is great. It was a very, you know, uh, I enjoyed the journey of writing the chapter with them. So I'm back again and uh, looking forward to this year too. Thank you. Good to have you join us. Fantastic. And last of all, Swati, because I will have to get you sharing some things. Yes. Hello, Swati. Are you on your way to work somewhere? Hi. Hi, everyone. Yes, I'm on my way to work. Can you all <laughs> hear me okay? Yeah, fine. Yes, I'm Swati and I've been working with Annie for last one year. And I'm just here to um, listen in and find out more about all these upcoming projects. Cool. Fantastic. All righty. Let me just share my screen then and I'll just give you some information. So I'm hoping by now that all of you have um, gone and downloaded our prospectus. So if you don't have a prospectus, just put your just put put um, a, a thing in the in the comments now. Just your email. Just say send me a prospectus. It's on womensbizglobal.com forward slash publishing so you can get a prospectus so basically we are all about we're in we're we're a new publishing um group so women's biz global has is has been growing massively and exponentially over the last year or two uh and so those of you who've done a previous book we did it all with women's biz but we actually went out to an external publisher we've now become our own publisher and so we've done all the training on that and so now we will be able to uh, be able to do every step of the way and call me a control freak but yeah that's going to work really well for me because I have realized very very clearly I cannot stand having other people even lovely people um just tell me things are going to be done at a certain way at a certain time and then I just have to wait and watch oh my gosh it just presses all my buttons so I'm super excited about being able to do that saying that I will make sure that I deliver for you in every single way so we are all about sharing stories I believe everyone has a voice everyone needs to have their their message and story shared 
to the world, uh, whether that is your own personal story, whether it's a part of your journey that you go, you know what, I just have to have this written um, and what that means. If you want to do it for total um, side hustle profit, uh, fantastic. If you want to have your own book, signature book to build your brand, uh, absolutely. I think everybody in business, if you're in business, should have a signature book that says this is what I mean. If you're asked to do a guest speak somewhere on something, um, what do they call you for? Um, such as, you know, Pudge is an IP expert. She should have an IP book. Do you know what I mean? Like when you speak at that event, what is someone wanting to go? I want more of you and your main area of expertise. So that's a goal, I believe, for every woman in business to have their own signature book. You could have a personal book. You can also find a really wonderful stepping stone is to therefore become part of an anthology, which means you just write a chapter of a book alongside all these other friggin' awesome women around the world, and then you actually get branding by association as well. So you get, instead of you just advertising it, you've got, you know, 18, you know, up to 18 people also advertising and you get all of their networks as well. Um, and so it grows your brand exponentially. So hopefully all of you are reading, going to read all of this. I'm not going to go through all of that now, but I do want to make sure that everyone has a prospectus. Those of you who've done things with me before, just know that if you're a member of Women's Biz Tribe, which is you pay $40 a month for that. If you've been a member for three months or more continuous, you get a 10% discount on anything you do with me. If you've been a previous author like with me, such as Pooja, uh, she would get a 13% discount. Um, two authors get 15, three authors get 17. And anyone who is a gold affiliate of mine, which means they refer people to me and um, we've got a good relationship, you would know if you are that person, you get a 17%. So I'm all into just really rewarding uh, people who work together in a consistent way. So you um, will have known, therefore, that we've got, um, you can do an individual book of your own, or at the moment, we have three anthologies plus one beautiful book about po of poems. So we've, bought, we've at the moment targeted January, February, March, January, we are going to be having a book called Heart Warrior, and I'll go into that. Uh, February, we are going to be writing Memoirs of Successful Women, which is pretty much your story of becoming successful. Um, it is the perfect book if you're going to one day write your memoir, because if you would write one chapter and you'd actually then expand every element of that for your own biography or autobiography. Uh, and then our third book is called Dream Big, Act Bigger. So I'll go into what they all are. Plus, we've got a book of poems that if you write a poem, you can just have a poem published. You can have one poem, you can have 10 poems. We don't mind. It's going to be a beautiful book of poetry. So how does it work with women's bids? We then have different packages. So if you're doing the anthology of any kind, it will come under the Ignite package, all right? So an Ignite package means that you, um, if you're doing an anthology, this is where it will sit. And the prices for that, if you are going to do your, uh, sorry, if you're going to do your own book, I've got US and Australian prices. And then we work out your discount if you are due one. Or if you're here today going, I want to be in Heart Warrior, I want to be in Memoirs and so forth, uh, these are the prices for your chapter. Your chapter is 3,000 words. You can go up to probably four and a half, five thousand. 5,000. We will definitely stop you uh, because, you know, it's a sharing book. <laughs> but uh, we're not like, you know, policing all of that. Under five, under threes, you know, we'll really try and get you to bump that up because we want each chapter to really be a great piece of work. Um, and so we will help you along the way with your anthologies. But we're so we're assuming um, that you um, have if you've done it before, you'll find it very easy. You'll just write your 3000 word uh, chapter and Ali will help you every step of the way on, you know, you know how to lay that out. If you've got any questions, um, we'll have a brief of obviously what each book is 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 about. Uh, if you uh, need help with that, you know, with our anthologies, we're actually very generous in the amount of help we will give you guidance. So if you haven't done, um, if, it, if this is your first 
um, journey into getting published, uh, we will be able to help. We won't ghostwrite it for you. We definitely want it to be your own work, your own way. But if um, the reason that most people go, I've had a book sitting in me and I haven't done it because they've just kind of got these handbrake of, is it good enough? I, I don't feel brave enough to show anyone my work. I don't know if I've got it right. And all of those sorts of things. We go, hey, it's going to be amazing. You are going to get there. Just show us what, what you've got. So, and I know others who've done work with us before will know that. So just show it to Ali and go, am I on the right track? It's always better to do that earlier than later. So even if you've just written 500 words or a thousand words, go, am I on, am I getting it, getting the gist? And she will direct you there rather than do all your 3000 and then get stressed, right? So uh, with everything women's biz, we're all about helping women succeed. So therefore we don't ever have an issue with anything. We like to come in early, just tell us um, what your concern might be if you've got any. Otherwise, we actually just have heaps of fun along the way. The great thing as well with an anthology is that, you know, pretty much you just write the chapter, you turn up, you you work with us to do that, and we will do everything else for you. We'll do the, we've already got the cover for you. We've, we'll, we'll do the typesetting for you. We'll be doing every single step of the editing levels. There'll be a couple of levels of editing. You will end up getting a final proof sent to you. So once we've got your chapter and it's been looked at by our editors twice it'll come back to you we'll we'll make sure that you sign off on your individual chapter you'll have an online form to do that you, that will say I have checked it and I am happy with absolutely every part of it saying that sometimes it looks different when it's in a book so we'll also once we've got those all together we will send you a proof copy of your book we will make sure that we, um, every single person has received the proof copy of their book and you're all happy to sign the book off, okay, because you're part of that collaboration, all right? So because you're all around the world and because po um, posts can take different timings, um, for me, I'm going to make sure that everyone has a copy of the book, they've all read it, they've all said yes, and then we will schedule the the launch to be about you know two weeks after that we'll have an online launch and then we'll also in the process talk about if you want to have your own launches and things like that we will help you with ideas but we don't want to have a situation that we're having a launch and someone doesn't have their book yet throughout the process you'll also be asked how many books so you'll be given um a book to a, a proof copy. You'll also be given uh, three copies complimentary with your package. And then you'll also um, be asked to say, how many books would you like to order? So that during the process, you'll also go, okay, well, I would like 24 copies or I'd like 48 copies or I want however many copies. You want to make sure that you've got them in your little box, like those of you who've watched me online this week, opening my box. It's super exciting. You want to make sure you've got those for when you tell all your friends, I've got a book because they'll want you to sign it. They'll want to be all part of it, right? Even though obviously you can buy it on Kindle and in any sort of bookshop around the world, you know, but you want to, you want to make sure that you've got your stock. So we will uh, be able to go through all of that process. We'll tell you when you need to let us know what you want to order and you order them with a discount code of um so you'll buy them at cost so you'll put in a special code that gets you 40 percent off and you will be able to therefore get them at cost and then you resell them to your people otherwise they'll be all at all of the obviously on amazon and barnes and noble and you know dimmix or wherever at all book, good booksellers those of you who are going to be doing your own book, you might choose to have that package, that Author One Ignite package. For those of you who are going to make that your own book, we're assuming that you have got that book in you, you've got all the nuts and bolts of it, you've been writing that book, It's it's it just needs the, the basic assistance from Ali to help guide you, maybe a bit of structural support, um, how to flesh some things out, things of that nature. If you're wanting uh, to get a little bit more bells and whistles on that, you might want to go the Elevate book package. That's going to give you 100 books as well, complimentary in it. It's a bit more expensive, but we'll also do a bit more effort and work with you on how to actually market that, sell that, um, and increase your sales. Uh, and so this one is probably for someone who's doing a signature book, who has a book that's on a hot topic that you're going to want to have some a bit more media as well um, and help maybe to flesh that whole memoir out, things of that nature. 
This third package is the premium support and exposure. It's called a Dominate Book Package. You get 250 books included in your package. Obviously, it's more expensive, but we will work with you on actually, you know, making sure that Ali or a professional um, ghostwriter will work alongside you to make sure that, you know, it is really, really a stellar book. All of your um, global marketing, your, your um, sales are all checked and um, we will go into a lot. Uh, you know, as like best detail we can as possible. You will see a tick list of what's included of extra support in all of those in the prospectus. So I won't go through all of those. Um, if you're wanting to know about Heart Warrior, I know a couple of you have already mentioned Heart Warrior. Heart Warrior is all about saying if you are a woman who is led by your heart, what you do is by your heart. It might be your work. It might also be your passion. It might be your community service. It might be saving whales it could be anything you know what do you actually go I am just heart driven I feel like a warrior I you know this is what I I, you know the dream is obviously if you can get your personal and your professional um, why sort of interlinked and you actually um, do that every day so the positioning there will set, say things like that you're a woman who wears your heart on your sleeve you feel unstoppable as you lead want to get change in a certain area you you actually are very brave and bold because other people will say, hey, you're crazy, hey, you're fanatical, hey, you're a bit too passionate, hey, you're super um, ridiculously enthusiastic about that. I love those stories because they're all about showing your true vulnerability. They're showing that you're happy to stand out on your own. You're happy to claim, uh, claim something as a personal passion. You have dr been driven maybe from trauma, maybe from a life experience, maybe something that you just want to change for your own reasons and it doesn't matter if everyone else agrees with you. So I love that. And I think people just love reading stories about that. Obviously, I'm flying through on this because I just want to make it quick and answer your questions. Uh, memoirs, memoirs of successful women. This is the one that's all saying, this, this is uh, primarily I started this um, concept because my podcast is called Memoirs of Successful Women. So I've invited the 200 plus people who've been on my podcast to go, hey, this one wouldn't be a really great one for you. It is an opportunity for you to go, this is my story in one chapter. It is also the perfect way of then building that into a future memoir. So it's all about, um, the difference in this is it's, it is all about you. It's all about your story. It might, you might have been you overcoming, had aha moments, moments that you made a choice that then helped you become more successful, what success means to you, what it looks like or what it feels like, how you measure it. Obviously, every chapter will be done in your own way, but this is for people who you don't have to be a CEO, but you have to be a real change maker. You have to be a thought leader. You have to go, I've I've pioneered something. I'm I am I'm really unstoppable in this space. But you don't have to be the best in the in any biz at this stage. You just want to have to go, I am successful and I'm I'm proud of that. And I want to share that journey because that journey inspires our future generation of young women. And that's what I'm all about. I want women to have role models. When they're asked who's your role model, and I get people going, I don't actually have any or I don't know any, that breaks my heart. So I really want to make sure that women share their story for themselves to be proud of who they are, for those who know and love them, to go, wow, girl, you're freaking awesome. And then also for women, uh, for readers around the world to go, wow, I want to be more like that person. And also they have someone to reach out to if, if you're in the same sort of area. Dream Big, Act Bigger is all about saying, you know what, I have a dream of who I want to be, what I want to achieve, who I want to become, and I have that dream and I'm going to make sure it's a big, bold dream. So when you talk about BHAG dreams, big, hairy, audacious goal dreams, that's what I'm all about. And then it says, but you know what, I have to actually act bigger. I have to act bigger than the average person maybe because I've got a disability, because I've got, you know, like I did, I had five children, including two sets of twins. I had to act bigger to them than the mo than most I had to act more creatively I had to pioneer things I had to not get disheartened I had to go around I had to sometimes create my own door if if the door wouldn't open you know um things of that nature so it, it's it is a bit like heart worry but it's different it's more about saying um it doesn't have to be heartfelt it actually just has to go but I'm going to do this I'm going to do this thing I am going to be an unstoppable force so that's kind of the the guts and feel of them I sorry I don't have the picture of the poetry book the poetry book um 
will is basically a book of poems um it's got a beautiful cover i will share with all of you the cover um on my socials as they come up but it's it's basically you can just have a, a poem of a uh, of a few words or a whole lot of words and it's basically a hundred dollars a poem and so it's just like you know or a discount if you're part of the tribe and blah 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 um so that's where we're currently sitting we've got people from obviously you are a beautiful group from around the world uh and we appreciate so um everything that we do through women's biz is from a global perspective so we don't do anything i'm australian those of you who aren't uh it doesn't it's actually irrelevant where i am um obviously if i'm australian and others are uh, we might be able to have, you know, connect for a launch or a speaking opportunity and things like that. Yes, you should always do that. Same as you American ladies. Uh, but we do everything online. We also have opportunities. What I love is the collective of everyone who comes through Women's Biz because it means that if you've got an opportunity such as a speaking or an event or something, you then meet all these people through this process that you go, oh, my gosh, let's team up. Let's um, let's capitalize on these relationships. So the value of the relationship with the collective is huge. Um, and those of you who've done things with me will already um, know that, that you'll suddenly get on other summit opportunities and, and you'll meet people that you'll see there's common interests. Um, you can help each other, share with each other and things of that nature. So that's enough speaking for me. I would love to have your questions. You're all just staring. Well, I, I can ask. Um, so it's like uh, the maximum people per authority yet, or what is the range of the authors you are looking for for each authority book? Great. So we um we generally I think we had 18 for this. This is probably too much. We probably stop at 15. We don't have to be as chunky. Uh so we we haven't reached our limit. So yes, tell a friend, tell anyone. We've definitely got them open at the moment. Saying that we're wanting to stay for time. So we're wanting to, we've got a very generous amount of time. When we say January, February, March, we've actually got like six months for each. So it's January to June, February to July, March till um. August. Um, with that, we need to make sure that, you know, you can have those situations that someone scoots in a little bit late. You could come in February for the January writing, saying that other people are finished, theirs will be proofed, but we won't, we won't hold up the timeline. We'll make sure that we have enough to actually have have a book so they're not full at this stage they could get full where I've got some paid advertising actually going out as we speak um, and we're getting a lot of inquiries from those so that's super exciting but at the moment it, it's it's not a problem but we do want to make sure that if you're in Ali will do the invoicing um, follow up you know the brief with you um, make sure that you've got yourself started and we'll follow that and then we'll have regular meetings um, throughout just to make sure that we all stay on track with time. I have a question, Annie. Um, yes. It's just in, in regards to the memoirs of successful women specifically. What is the deadline to submit our? Uh, the ideal deadline is end of uh, February. So you want to, we've dedicated that, tr you know, try and use the month. So Heart Warrior people hopefully have already started or are thinking and really we're trying to go, wouldn't it be great if you were finished by end of January? Obviously, you probably got a buffer month, month because during, if those of you who finished mon um, January, they'll be getting, ed they'll have a month of editing and review back and forth with Ali with each individual author. So you're in the memoirs book. We're trying to get all of those first drafts finished by end of February so that in March Ali will be spending that month going back and forth with with each individual author see how it works so obviously you've got another author we do have a bit of wiggle room but we don't want to plan ideally for wiggle room um, we will make sure that because we want to have three months at the end that everything is going through our professional editing team we've got our proofs you've had time to you know get your book you read it we want to make sure that by the six month stage each process will um, we'll be able to launch it. The ideal goal is that we need we want to have all three anthologies published before the Christmas run, right? So even though we're sitting here in January, things take time. We want to be in the catalogs for book orders um, in by September, October, so that people they're they're in the right the best catalog of the year, so that it's 
or Christmas presents, right? That's the way the publishing world works. You can publish at any time, but let's go for gold. Uh, that's the way we want to do it. So all three will meet that. We've actually just staggered them because we want to make sure that we can obviously deliver on our, um, our lead times for you. Thank you. Sorry, welcome, Sharon. I didn't welcome you before. Um, oh, I'm so sorry I'm late. But <laughs> I've got builders here and I had a sort of organiser. That's fine. Sorry, sorry. That's fine. That's fine. It's Hello, right everybody. Anyway. Hello, Susan. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> Did anyone else have questions? Annie, do we have any template this time uh, for the, you know, the layout of the chapter? Ali, do you want to speak to that? Um, so, Peter, just to clarify, do you mean in terms of um, the sort of like the themed structured outline, sort of like how you'd intro it, what would be the message, how many points? Yeah. I'm actually I'm actually doing something up. I, we do have a resource that was used um, for this exact purpose, but in terms of this, I know there's a few people in the chat. So what I'll do is I'll finish that and I can send that around. But yeah, there is there is pivotal points on on how to maximize the chapter, yeah, to, to get that message through. Yeah. So I'll, okay. I'll get that to you. Yeah. yeah. Thanks. There, there's pros, there's pros and cons of that. One, we want it to really have make sure it has your voice. You don't want to be writing to a formula. This is a moment to go. You know, if I've got three thousand words to write about, you know why I'm a heart warrior or my journey or how I've become successful. You want to do that. Saying that, you've obviously always got to have like an introduction, a middle and an end. It's got to tie together. There's ways of doing that. But we don't want to have like in the, you know, the spaghetti recipe, We are I'm all into authenticity and really feeling like if I met that person, I feel like they're speaking to me and I can hear their voice. Do you know what I mean? Uh, so, yeah. so they're so just following the happened? same format as the earlier one. Yeah, so the same sort of format would be great. Uh, saying that, Ali will definitely just give a, a, a basic outline, but which helps. I know a, a little bit will help you, um, but they will all sort of come out sort of obviously sure. unique. Sure. Thanks. Yeah. yeah. And, and just with that, obviously, um, just to add on, you'll probably have lots of other various questions around the publishing process in terms of the PR component to it and then the launch. Um, so I'm doing some FAQs as well, just so you've got that insight into the whole process and not necessarily just the book writing process. So you've got a little visualization there for what the whole picture looks like before, mid and end. Yes, yes, yes. Um, cool, cool, cool. Hang on. Sorry, I was just going to share a link with you all just while I'm thinking about it. Um, all righty. Um, Oh, sorry, that just went to Laura, not everybody. All righty. Um, yes, that's right. So so even though we're just having this little intro, it's pretty much to say, hey, if you're doing Heart Warrior, get your skates on. We're really here to make sure that that happens. We'd love you to be part of that. If you know anyone else who's interested you think would be great for this, make sure they know about it because we are going to be full steam ahead. If you have absolutely any questions, yes, you can ask me. If I, often I'm sort of just at an other different sort of level, but Ali knows all the details. So Ali will become your best friend. Um, you can ask either of us. It doesn't uh, doesn't matter. So, um, and you can always, yeah, contact us at any time. I don't actually work 24 seven. I just make it look like I do. Uh, but I've also encouraged you, I've put a link in the chat uh, to join our tribe. So we've got a brand new web platform if you're wanting to know a bit more about Women's Biz as well. If you're thinking, well, who am I getting connected with? You've got a first month when you join up, it's a first month free trial, um, but you'll be able to have a very good, you'll get a couple of boot camps from me so that you'll get a feel for who I am, um, Rosie. Uh, there's a Be More and an Ermal boot camp. There's also um, like 200 resources, videos of different people. You'll see Sunny speak at, a, at an event. You'll speak, see Pugia and Ali and all these amazing people. Um, so it just makes you feel, I, I think it's really important when I get into something, I want to know what, who am I getting in with, right? <laughs> so I think that's really great. So my style is always very open and transparent. So come along, join. Um, you can unsubscribe at any time. Of course, it'll ask you to stay and we would love you to stay. You don't have to be a member of the tribe to, um, to be in any of our events, summits, uh, books, things of that nature. But obviously we love it when you are. Uh, so that's that's it. Um, any other questions about the book or how to progress? Does anyone? Oh, Sharon's got a question. One more. 
Um, Annie, what happens if you've written for Heart Warrior, which I have, and then it's more suited to memoirs? Would you tell us? Yes. Yes. Ah, okay. So when Ali, Ali will be as soon as you've written them and submitted, um, and it doesn't want, can I highlight, it doesn't have to be your final thing to submit. All right. So just go, this is where I'm at at the moment. Do you think it's good enough? Because that's the number one question. Is it good enough? Um, so just send it to her. And, and I know Susie's just had that moment too. I thought I was going one way and now I'm going to go another way. Um, it's, it's the most important thing goes, yeah, this, my story really resonates with the whole S ethos of the book so um she will let you know and then it's usually very easy to a lot of them can be they've just got a there's a slight different change on the way on the on the why of the of your chapter so um yeah she'll let you know that she thinks it's better in a different one cool, cool. you also look wonderful today you look amazing oh <laughs> <laughs> here I am thinking I've still got my beachy slightly frizzy hair but there you go <laughs> oh, classic classic it's true uh, always a glamour Annie always <laughs> thank you oh my goodness you girls boost my self-esteem always all right any other questions no all right so those of you who are listening in re-watching this because I know we're on different time zones many people have missed it uh definitely just always reach out to me you can dm me you can get me at annie at anniegibbons.com you can get me at hello at womensbizglobal.com you can get me through any of the socials just drop me a line if I'm not too sure I'll put you in touch with Ali anyway um the biggest thing is that it is seriously possible for everyone to get published so uh you know there's nothing holding you back if you and the biggest thing that holds people back is generally themselves. It's like this, it's this imposter syndrome, but I'm not a real author. You've got no idea. I had two books out and I was still saying, but I'm not a real author like you, like, because I went to this writer's retreat and they're looking at me like, what? You are, like, seriously, even if you have got one poem in a book, you're going to be a globally published poet, right? Uh, so make this happen for yourself. Uh, we will hold your hand. That's the that's big difference that we will do that without taking control of who you are. Our biggest thing is making you feel supported while having your 100% authenticity um, in what you do. And so that is the, that's the soul flavor of women's biz. Uh, so I look forward to seeing what comes up. Um, Ali will make sure that the magic happens at the back end. I will be um, having regular meetings with those who are now progressing. And uh, yeah, I'm super excited and pumped about the year ahead. So thank you so much for all of your interest. And um, I look forward to reading your words. It's going to be amazing. <laughs> Alrighty. Have a great day, everybody. Bye. Thanks, Annie.